Did I hear a donation while I was upstairs? Did somebody donate during the break? Hey everybody, Jeff here. Welcome back to the N7 Day Extra Life... Uh, oh, what did I call it? Uh, Extremaganza? <laughs> um, we've hit... We're in hour 12. We've hit the halfway point, people. Uh... There we go. <sighs> Welcome back, everybody. And if you're just joining in, like I said, this is the N7 Day Extra Life 24-hour stream. Uh, we're raising money for Children's Hospital of Wisconsin. We're looking... We're at $620. We're looking to get another $180 to hit our new goal of $700. Uh, all $10 donations get you in the prize pool. Uh, we've still got some gift cards. We've got... Grunt plushie. We've got... The very, very cool N7 Nerf gun. It has been... Calibrations have been performed. It has been modded for extra dart, distance, and power. That one's going to be a lot of fun. 24 great... I mean... Not too bad yet. <laughs> uh, but we just finished up the first chunk of the game. We got all of our first... Uh, which I assume moves us on to... I think we've basically finished a third of the game. If I'm... Whoop. What? There we go. Okay, don't do that to me. Uh, let's delete that. New save. Uh, Kemp donated. Sorry. Let me pull it up. I just had it up a second ago. Uh, Kemp donated with $10. Thank you so much, Kemp. Uh, that's going to go towards helping uh, some sick kids with whatever it is they need. Whether that's medical stuff or if the doctors are like, let's just buy them some toys. That's what they're going to end up with. All right. Uh, Kelly, you said... Jack's tattoos are beautiful. As colorful as her past, I'm sure. I have concerns with her temper, though. Oh, you have concerns about her temper. Okay. You have worries about Jack? I know she'll be solid under fire, but her attitude suggests deep personal issues. She pushes people away, yet approaches the giant... sex casually. I don't think she understands The giant Omega interests. tattoo on her back didn't Just give it away? be careful when talking about personal matters. I'll do my best not to piss her off. Please warn me if you fail. I want a chance to hide. Anyway, what's up? Uh, nothing. Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. Are these all the same as we had before? This organization has a dark reputation. Do you have any concerns working for them? Not at all. Our methods can be harsh, but Cerberus has noble objectives. We look out for human interests. Advanced human technology. Okay, save we, uh, human lives. yeah, we They're did good that, goals. so. All right, you have nothing new for us, Kelly. Goodbye. Take care. I believe the elusive man wants... I don't even know where that is. Where's the... Debriefing room cock. Is it the debriefing room? It's got to be the debriefing room, right? There we go. I was like, I don't remember it having a table, but that's why. Shepard, I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morden delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. One of your former crew, Ashley Williams. She's stationed on Horizon. Go figure. I was, I was going to say, is somebody I know there? 
Last I knew, Ash was Alliance. Why is she out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies. But they're up to something. And if they sent Chief Williams, it must be big. Perhaps you should take it up with her. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew. I don't know. I mean, you have a lot of crew members and they're all over the place. You'd be surprised the Collectors are interested in you. Especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after her to get to you. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Yeah. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance Art getting Jean, in our way. come on! Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. Oh, I somehow doubt that. Considering how wanted you are. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the professor. Aye, aye, Commander. Oh, look at that little... Oh, God. It was cute for a moment. Tell me you have something. Yes. Why are we looking at a woman's torso? Uh, well, that was a map, I think. Otherwise, I'm pretty certain it was a rendering of Shepard's chest. Lilith, we've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those Glad to see they still don't load. There we go. Out. Sorry, Chief. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Back, you making me... <laughs> okay. Come. Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. There's never a bad time it's for Mass Effect. Personal. What? What is that? Is going on with the graphics? Get everyone. You're to gonna the need a bigger house. gun. Oh yeah, no, it's gonna. It's. It, <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if it's the hottest selling game next year. Finally get to see the collectors. They look like bugs mixed with crustaceans. And their ship kind of looks like a hive. Okay. <laughs> Mass Effect 3, the difference between 2 and 3 wasn't that big. You do get the, the Omni Blade in 3, though. Which I didn't I didn't realize going to this. I thought I had an Omni Blade in this as well. You know what? We're 12 hours into this, and I haven't gotten my Omni Blade out. Ugh. We are the harbinger of their perfection. They have these shields for ascension. Another... Harbin I was going to say Harbinger. Okay.
All right. So, I mean... What are we dealing with? I don't know what the collectors have in terms of... Uh... Yeah, Satri, I was talking about that earlier. Like, I, uh, I wonder if they're going to include the Mass Effect 3 multiplayer in the Legendary Edition. Uh, because originally, when Mass Effect 3 came out before the Citadel DLC, uh, you had to play the multiplayer to get the best ending possible. Um, later on, they introduced that DLC, and they made it possible to get 100% galactic readiness without any multiplayer stuff. But it was a lot of fun. wasn't as fun as the uh, Andromeda multiplayer, in my opinion. That was amazing. I had a blast with the Andromeda multiplayer. But Mass Effect 3 multiplayer was a lot of fun. Um, okay, we're dealing with bugs. We're dealing with collectors. How much tech are we going to be dealing with? I'm thinking raw strength and biotics, maybe? Hold on. Yeah, I'm thinking biotics and raw strength. I think they uh, did that so people didn't dismiss multiplayer outright. True. Probably. I mean, I, I feel like it was fun enough that once word of mouth got around, it wouldn't matter. Oh, she's got warp. No, she doesn't even have warp ammo yet. Okay. Okay. So she has Shockwave and Pull. I'm just looking at Biotics here. I'm thinking Grunt and Miranda. Hold on a moment. I don't think the Collectors use much in the way of shields. I think they had... Uh, like biotic fields and stuff like that. So I want incendiary and concussive. And... Warp will take out the shield, the, the fields, right? I don't know that shockwave or pull will help with that. Took me a while, but once I got the weapons I wanted in ME3 multiplayer, it was... Oh, that's right, you had to get weapons, didn't you? Jack, you're going to have to wait for another day. The Mass Effect 3 multiplayer or the, the Andromeda stuff? There's my cryo ammo. All right, we're going in. Grunt, did I do your shotgun? I didn't do your shotgun yet. I'm sorry, Grunt. Emmy three. <laughs> I'm trying to do like three things at once, guys. I just don't remember much of the M the the three multiplayer is the problem. Like, I think I remember some of the stages, but that's about it. We're ground side. Morden, you sure those armor upgrades will protect us from the Seeker Swarm? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confuse detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. Hopefully, because we're about to walk into it. technology, only test is contact with Seeker Swarms. Look forward to seeing if you survive. Jeez. Thank you, Morden. You're... Confidence is reassuring. Oop, okay. Yep, we got uh, barriers. So that means, what do I want for barrier? Armor. Nothing works with barriers that I have. So, uh, you know what does though? 
warp. That one hit. Ooh. On the ground now. That's all right. Grunt gets some time to shine. Hundred hours into the ME3. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, I'm pretty sure none of those servers are still running. Maybe, I don't know. Mass Effect 3 is on PC, though. They might be on there still. Alright. Um... Oh, crap. No. What? No. What the actual hell? I'm not losing a thing to that. Don't judge me. We're 12, 12 and a half hours in and I've only restarted, like, what, twice? <laughs> I wonder if there are any servers still running. That'd be fun. And it, it was popular enough, I feel like, that they're, like... If there was a possibility for fan servers to stay running, they would have. We're ground side. Morden, you sure those armor upgrades will protect us from the seeker swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confuse detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. In theory. Experimental technology. Only test is contact with seeker swarms. Look forward. I don't know if that'll reach. Seeing if you survive. Felt that one. Yeah, right on your ass. Wait, did he say right up your ass? <clears throat> Oh, I was gonna shoot him. Fine. Die, die. <laughs> right? Which is weird because he's only like technically a couple days old, right? Just making sure. Gonna be smart about it this time. There we go. Actually, I'm going to say 6,000 credits was worth it. The trend of me having trouble spend, uh, spelling is coming back to... Eh, no worries. We all knew what you meant. Commander, we're getting up interference. We can't maintain the spell. The collectors are dissenting We're on our own now. That's a big boy. Die already, die already. 
Oh, yay, husks. Gotta love husks. Shotgun time. Burn and die. Holy crap, run. Those things look like the husks that Geth used on Eden Prime. Then your elusive man is right. Might be useful. Heavy skin weave, nice. Upgrades, keep them coming. Okay, there's still the big giant. Oh, look at it, it's a lot more. Um, the big giant thing I saw lumbering around. That's got me a little worried. Sort of looks human. This one of the colonists? No. On Eden Prime, victims were turned into husks by impaling them on spikes. We haven't seen any. The collectors must have brought the husks. They're taking the colonists alive for something else. Probably to turn them into husks, right? Collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Speculation will get us nowhere. It could be anything. Guess we'll find out when we stop them. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced. Evolved. They still die when you shoot them. And at the end of the day, isn't that what matters? The collectors aren't getting <coughs> away with more victims. Let's move out. Yes, ma'am. Oh, they set up shop quick. Just like freedom's progress. You know what these things kind of remind me of? Anybody ever play, um... Grumped? <laughs> yeah, he does. Um, the Resistance games. Uh, I think in the first one, and maybe the second, uh, like, the, the things that the Chimera use for, like converting humans. They're just these tanks that they just have set up in towns and stuff like that. It kind of reminds me of this. Oh, is that a freaking laser beam? Be drunk if you could get out of the way. You guys keep fighting. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. Mmm. <laughs> give me some of that good stuff. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Don't turn around on me like that. I was about to shoot you. Well, that's a thing. Can I jump this? Nope. Okay. Then how do I... Like, there's something down there, clearly. How do I... How do I do over there? Can 
We like... Nope. Okay. It's like, I might have an easy way to save these people, but I guess not. Hello. Seems to be some kind of stasis field. Keeps you conscious, but completely helpless. Oh, that's terrifying like this sounding. A long time. All right, this goes up and over. These go over here. I'm gonna say we do up and over. White wall of text. Ugh. Glad we went up. All right, it's just items. Okay. Collector particle beam. Shepard, great. So, what did that replace? My grenade launcher? Ugh, fine. Mass Effect 2 minigames, I did not. <laughs> I don't even remember how they work in Mass Effect 3. But you still have the, the connect the dots one, don't you? It's been a long time since I played three, so. Why did they get? Oh, that's not really a jetpack, is it? Oh shit! He's going ultra instinct. Before that happens, though, I need to finish searching all of these houses. Alright, uh... Oh, Miranda, why don't you have a warp? Run away from the superpower guy! You cannot win, Space Dick. I have the high ground. Also, there's a fucking Krogan down there. So you have fun. If these guys have been mostly attacking human colonies, like, probably haven't dealt, dealt with too many Krogan, huh? Excuse me. Was I in here? I was, wasn't I? Oh god, what the hell is that? A blood shield! That's all the building. I'm just, I don't want to miss out on any upgrades. Again, I'm not sure if this is one of the planets I can revisit.
based on how fucked everything is, though, I'm gonna say no. In fact, you know what? Hold on. I'm just gonna check real quick. Just give me the... Okay. Particle beam. Heavy skin weave. And biotic damage. heavy skin weave, didn't I? Okay. Let's do this. See, this one's not so bad. The other one, though, is annoying as hell. Company. Get out here. Now! You're... You're human. What are you doing out here? You lead them right here. You from Jersey? You had to hear them trying to get in. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan. Mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed at Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. As fun as it is to bag on Ash, I don't think it's her fault. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. <laughs> no, Chief Lilith! Williams. Heard she was some kind of hero or something. Didn't mean nothing to me, though. Would rather she just stayed back in council space. Any idea what she was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling she was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. Oh my god, you remind me of too many real people. <sighs> Tell me about the colony defense towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered Guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. Uh, are you sure it wasn't the person aiming the gun? Were you by chance in charge of aiming the gun? Why do you think this is the Alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left Council Space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. I mean... <laughs> I saved the galaxy by getting mix, uh, mixed up with them, so... The Collectors are targeting remote colonies. The Alliance was trying to help. I don't need their help. Too many strings attached. That rep said she was just here to get the towers online, but mark my words, there's more to it. If you have defenses, we can use Yeah, them actually, the gun towers would be super helpful. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. We can Damn figure it. it out. Calibrations Just and we don't have Garrus. It. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. Always bring Garrus. 
You know this colony and the equipment. You better come with us. Oh, that's no, no yeah. Chance in hell. Yeah, you stay here. You'd probably just get in the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. Anyone ever tell you you're kind of a dick mechanic? And by kind of, I mean you're a giant dick. Okay, I'm gonna take your platinum and your credits. I think we're good with this outload or loadout. quiet too quiet also that's way too many uh, lawnmowers On our right. where what oh shit I see them okay never mind I retract my previous question you're shooting me makes it really hard to shoot the guys I want to shoot. Damn. Run. Nothing stands against us. Are you sure? Because I'm pretty sure I just shot you in the face, so... Oh, there's a big disgusting thing I saw earlier. Why do they gotta be all like bloated? Oh my god, it's disgusting. Somebody do something about that horrifying thing. Is that the only one left? I think that's the only thing left. Scions, huh? They seemed nice. Alright, reload everything while I've got a moment. Lesson learned. Why is the objective that way? That's where I came from. You're making no sense, game. Thought I heard something, but maybe not. Oh, we're about we're gonna hit hour thirteen in a, in about ten minutes here. Woo! I'm actually feeling pretty good, all things considered. Now, now that like the the coffee stomach left. I love that like trash bin technology hasn't updated at all in a, like a what is it a thousand years a <laughs> hundred like what, what is this 21 what year is this cheers for thirds thank you so much for the hundred bits Kemp thank you so much I hope everybody's having fun I haven't gotten too loopy yet so I feel like we're doing good on that that uh that front that battle is being won How long? It. How long before I start ranting and raving about giant bats swooping, manta rays swooping out of the sky? Poor bastard, you'll see him soon enough. Jempo! 
How's it going, Jampo? Welcome to my Extra Life N7 Day stream. They've been taking them. Wait, what did I get off that collector? I am doing great, thank you. How are you doing? Are you enjoying the fall weather? So that's a whole loop of that. What did I get off of this? Oh, crap, I wasn't paying attention. <sighs> Whatever, let's go. Did I see it? Hero Brian, hello, how's it going? Did I see what? <laughs> I've seen many things. I've <laughs> We've been streaming for 12 hours, almost 13. The things that I am seeing. Eh, whatever. Whatever it was, I got it, so it doesn't matter. The big thing, yes, yes, the Mass Effect news, yes, I did. Oh, uh, well, I mean, there was lots of big things from yesterday. <laughs> there were a ton. There was possibly too much news yesterday. Modern Community Showcase. <laughs> that I didn't see, I guess. Uh, apparently I missed that. However, I have been playing this game for 13 hours, so... I imagine there's, uh, at this point, I've missed everything from the second half of the day. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. I want the other, I want the other ammo. Oh, refresh, come on. Oh, I remember this area. This area sucks, if I recall. Hello there. Oh, it's just another one of you. You're not that big a deal. Here. Uh, what about... Here we go. Eat particle beam. There we go. Ow, what the... Oh, back off. Assholes. Heal, please. Thank you. Uh, somebody. Oh, nobody has anything. No shield. One more. Should have run. Now you're fried. Eat particle beam. There we go. One mod with the change log. 350? Oof. That's nuts. Alright. It got quiet. I don't like it. I really don't like it. I feel like that computer hack is... 
That's going to trigger the next thing, so... Uh, thank you, Sarah. Yes, we are doing uh, the Extra Life stream today, too. Um, we're looking to get up to $700 here. Uh, $10 gets you into the prize wheel. We've still got some gift cards left. We've got the Grunt plushie. We've got the very awesome N7 modded Nerf gun. So if any of that sounds appealing and you feel like donating to a great cause, $10 gets you in that prize pool. All right, I think we got... Oh, 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 no, okay. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, I hate these. Okay. Lamo. Normandy, do you copy? Joker here. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. The collectors will try to stop it. Good. Got any okay, helpful Grant, tips? That... Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. Oh, they're always ready. Uh, what direction, though, is my question. Defend the tower? Assuming direct control. Mm. Alright, um... Oh, she doesn't have her... Focus on Shepard. Whoa, you can back right off, sir. Back off! Thank you. Oh, he just vanished. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. Somebody there, you've got the shield. Or the barrier. Punch, punch, punch. Back up. Right on your ass. You've got an ass fixation, don't you, Grunt? It's a little weird. <laughs> Who shot me and where'd you shoot me from? There will be more. There's always. I know, that's why I ran out here to get ammo. Oh, that sounds big. Where's that come from? Guardian anti ship batteries at forty percent. More coming. Guess we got their attention. Where, there we go. Barrier, please. We'll replace it. Or warp, I mean. Oh, Deal with the barrier. This form is irrelevant. Ooh. Okay, we're fine, we're fine.
go. More ammo, please. Let's go see more. Of course not. That's only two waves. Which way are they coming from, though? That's what I need to know. Oh! Okay, it's a giant flying crustacean. Spider thing with a mouthful of skulls. What the? Oh, uh, oh, <laughs> I was gonna say, someone tell me what that is, please. you know if you get uh, pulled during one of the prize drawings. That's right, you run away. Go on. They have most of the humans on board. They got with No! Don't let him get away! There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something! Well... <laughs> you shouldn't have hung out in the hangar or the garage. I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. It was a good fight, Shepard. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard. Captain of course, of Ash got left. The first human specter. Savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan. Back from the dead. Uh, okay, oh, back off, off my dick a little bit. Lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you alliance types. I'm going to join the circus. I thought you were dead, Commander. You'll fit in good there, clown. We all did. <coughs> it's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it. You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened. Ah, uh, well, I died, you anywhere, and I was commander. dead for most I of it. I thought you so. were gone. I, you were more than our commander. Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? Because I was dead. Too much time has passed. I wasn't even. Yeah, I wasn't. I have important things to do. <sighs> Not my choice. I spent the last two years in some kind of coma while Cerberus rebuilt me. Oh. Yep. You're with Cerberus now? I can't believe the reports were right. Reports? So much for security. Well, we haven't been Alliance quiet about Intel it. Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. I got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. I mean, Cerberus is a bunch of terrorists, but they're not the ones doing this. Our colonies are disappearing. The Alliance turned its back on them. Cerberus is the only group willing to do something about it. Bullshit. I know what Cerberus is like. They talk about putting humans first, but at what cost? I wanted to believe that you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. Pretty sure I died for everything we stood for, so is my controller dying? No, it's just freaking out. Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The 
collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. Oh, I don't, believe do me. You? What if they're behind I just let a convict into the all their secure the systems. Typical Alliance attitude. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're blind to the real threat. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of the facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. Yeah, you did a I'm lot of complaining about what was in your blood them as far as Alliance story. history is concerned in the last game, if I remember correctly, Ash. I could use someone like you and my crew, Ash. It'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'm no fan of aliens, but Cerberus has a history of being There experienced. it is. I'll never work for a group like that. So long, Commander. Good luck. I am racist, but I'm not that racist. That's all right, you're a shit shot anyways. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. All right, give me one second. I gotta figure out something. My knee is starting to kill me. I gotta find something to prop my, uh, I can put my foot up. Give me one moment, I got a box around here. Oh, yeah, there we go. My knee was starting to fuse into a single mass. Single solid mass of bone. Not the best feeling. Worst part is the couch I'm sitting on actually reclines. But if I put the footrest out, it's going to knock the camera over. All right. Excuse me while I try and get comfortable. I've been sitting here for 13 hours, so. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the collectors will think twice before attacking another Really? Because it seems like they won. <laughs> they got most of the people. It's not a victory. We interrupted the collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony, and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Ash said the Alliance got Wait a minute, wait, what do you, do you mean service? lure them in? Was that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive, and with Cerberus. You dick. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony, just to lure the Collectors there? A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you, or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. 
I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. Not cool, dude. We have to make sure they don't abduct anyone else. I want the Collectors stopped for that very reason. That's why we're doing this, Shepard. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? No, fuck you. None of your damn business. <laughs> if it affects the mission, better you should leave it behind. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Uh, my team kicks ass. Thank you very much. Let me worry about them. You just find us a way to the Collector homeworld. I just want to be upfront about your odds. You'll need everyone at their best. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. <laughs> be careful, Shepard. You're not wrong. Watching you. A little bit more sleep. He's got a little more sleep, though. I guess we're really going to do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. Take the fight to the Collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, makes you think. Nah, we got this. They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? Ah, uh, we got the personal missions. Oh, you guys did? Oh, cool. I, I can't wait to hear that. That's going to be a lot of fun. Sarah watched it like three or four times the first day we had it. <laughs> All right. So what's our new thing? Uh, Tali, the Justicar, the Assassin. Oh, and we have all of the... Uh, Miranda, the Prodigal, Jacob, the Gift of Greatness. Commander, sorry I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. I always have time for my crew. What is it? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. But... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. I thought you said you didn't have any. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back. The ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I buried everything but a body. Now, I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. Uh-oh. I think you'd be more excited that your father might be alive. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help, I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. Okay. Any signs that this is a Cerberus front? Who passed this to you? I doubt the elusive man would let a direct operation stake hold this long. If there's a link, it's probably just about money. Cerberus needs diverse holdings to fund projects like, well, you. And whoever sent this my way covered their tracks. Someone could be fishing for favors, or thought it would get under my skin. Who knows with that bunch. Tell me about the Hugo Gernsback and what it was doing. Why would Probably anyone name a ship frigate. something that stupid? I looked over the mission brief when it disappeared. Nothing stood out. Typical research and grab operation. Find an uncharted planet, stake a claim, and establish as large a presence as you can as fast as possible to shut out competitors. 
You didn't get along with your father? He made no apologies, I'll give him that. You make a mistake, you own up to it. Even if you keep making it. Whatever problems we had were a lifetime ago. I've had ten years to get to where I am. And as far as I know, he's still a ghost. Yeah, I mean... Just because the ship he was in command of, you know, suddenly sent out a distress signal, doesn't mean he's not dead still. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record. Hold on a second. Time for another one of these. What are these? Strike Force energy drinks. First one was pretty tasty, if a little too fizzy for my taste. Definitely uh, mess with my stomach a little bit. something horribly just waiting make sure we put the lid on all the way so that when I shake it up it doesn't get everywhere dummy in a mask how's it going I'm I'm working on it yeah what are we uh, just over 13 hours in I'll honestly be happy like we hit our original goal we got halfway to our secondary goal I'll be happy if I can make it the same amount of time as last year which was about 15 hours but, uh, if I can keep, like, the, the levels of uh, banana, um, carbonation, and hydration, and caffeine even, I really want to do the full 24. <laughs> and there's still plenty of prizes. If you want to donate to a great cause, we've still got a bunch of gift cards to give away. We've still got the Nerf gun. We've still got the... Uh, Garrus plushie, or Garrus, <laughs> Grunt plushie. I wish we had a Garrus plushie. That'd be awesome. Oh, that is going to fuck with my stomach. Look how bubbly that is. Uh, let's let that air out for a little while, huh? Can you hear that? Is it pick up the bubbles? <laughs> My cup doesn't fit in this cup holder. What the fuck? Okay. I don't know how much I have to shake it. There's literally no instructions. <laughs> and the last time I did it, it, I didn't shake it up enough. It, like, coated my mouth. And, like, I felt like... <laughs> 
I felt like my teeth had hair. Uh, if any of my phone calls with you have been any, been any indication, I don't survive well. There's a lot of depression and anxiety and um, pacing and watching Mystery Science Theater 3000. Okay. Two. Well, I mean, I want that cryo ammo, so. <coughs> that means it's working? What, the, the depression and the anxiety? What, what are you saying? Sarah, did, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Who else needs a talking to? Uh, Miranda. Yeah, that doesn't seem right. Shepard, how can I help? Is the lab working well for you? Quite satisfactory. Found a few surveillance bugs. Destroyed most of them. Returned expensive one to Miranda. Nothing unexpected. Just need more samples. More collector data, tissue samples, anything you can get, I can use. Find new tech. Dummy in a mask! Add a card! Thank you for that. Crap, I missed it. <laughs> Hold on. Dude, no, don't worry about it. Every 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 dollar helps. Every cent helps. So do not feel even a little bit bad. You're still helping out a great cause. Like I don't I, I I've said it the whole time, I don't judge anybody for not being able to donate or for only being able to donate so much. Like it's a rough year for everyone, you know? Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, nobody should get judged for not being able to donate a certain amount. The fact that you, like, are donating at all, you know, like, you're, you got, uh, I've been saying it all night, but you guys are the real heroes here. I'm sitting on my ass, playing video games, trying not to fall asleep or get, like, sick from eating too many bananas. <laughs> you guys are the real heroes here. I spent a bunch of money not on sick kids, but to uh, buy prizes for donators, because I feel like you guys should be rewarded for what you're doing. You guys are the actual heroes here. I am literally the middleman, and uh, my general opinion of middlemen is fuck the middleman. So don't worry even a bit. <laughs> Oh, look at those green eyes. Have you got a minute to talk? Not at the moment. Think I've unlocked anything else? Nope, nothing. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need. All right, so we got to find Miranda still. <coughs> Palladium. I can do the skin weave. Retrain. No, why? No, no! <laughs> I like my powers where they are, thank you. <laughs> it's the same, like, here's here's the thing, guys. Like, I always appreciate don uh, bits and subs and follows and donations and all that kind of stuff. But, like, my big thing is, like, don't do anything you're not comfortable with. And most importantly, have fun. Okay? That's why I always push the Facebook page. My tongue is getting numb. <laughs> I've been talking for 13 hours. That's why I always put, the, uh, not the Facebook page, the YouTube page. Because subs are super, actually really helpful over there, and they're totally free. Like, I, I'm not expecting anything from anyone. Okay? My, my only hope is that people are enjoying themselves watching this. Okay? And we already hit our goal. We hit our goal and then some. Like, we, 
at this point, everything is just gravy and frosting and sauce and whatever things you add. Salt? Whatever you add to stuff that makes it better. I don't know. I'm not... I make grilled cheese, okay? <laughs> um, like, but, like, really, though, we're all... The work that has been done here today in this stupid stream has been... Has blown me away. Like, I wasn't expecting it at all. So thank you, everybody. You shush. You, you're married to me. You don't get to call me buddy. Oh, I still can't afford the med bay. Are you kidding me? Uh, okay. Um... the biotic damage. Wait, wait, what? What? Oh, it's still platinum. I don't want to spend any more platinum. Seasoning. <laughs> All right, where's Miranda? Commander, you've received a new message at your private time. We forgot to feed the fish! Please don't be dead. Yes, okay. Not dead. Awesome. Now we gotta say hello to... S what was it? Spamster? Yeah, Spamster to the space hamster. Hello, Spamster. How are you? Meep. Oh, you're so cute. Meep. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hack at Alliance HQ. I mean, Commander, it's only 12.30 there, right? Thank you for your time. I'll keep this brief. We have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space. Name's Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. So why call me? Just this morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. Okay, this is like end of the game level DLC, if I remember. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and an alliance agent working in Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I won't let her run away in a Batarian torture camp. Yeah, I don't think anyone would want to rot away in a Batarian torture camp. Or really any torture camp, but... What's Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative. She I think all of us should sleep. We talk only when we have to. Me especially. I heard but she was investigating a rumor no, of a real artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. Wait. I already forgot what I just picked. Okay, hold on. What's Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. We talk only when we have to. I heard she was investigating a rumor of okay. a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device. Proof that Isn't the Reapers there... are indeed planning invade i've known her a long time if she says she has proof no there's something in universe i don't think they bring it up until the third game but it's like it's like a batarian leviathan or something they think they find like a reaper corpse or something like that Batarians won't take kindly to the Alliance breaking into a secret prison. This is not an Alliance operation. It's one person going in alone to save a friend. If it 
were an official mission, of course the Vitarians would be upset. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Jensen is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers... Yeah, I know. They, it's, it. it's a major it's part of man. one of the DLCs of the third game. Or don't go at all. I did this one too, right? What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and an alliance agent working in Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment, and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She and I go back pretty far, okay. Commander. I won't let her run away. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground at a Batarian outpost. Oh! I'll upload the coordinates. No. 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 I've been waiting for something like that to happen. I've been waiting. Stream quality is fine though, right? All right, we're back in. Do not restart. When was the last save? What do you ch What do you mean cheater? You don't even know how it works. I hate how Xbox does their network. Like, why couldn't you just make it like PlayStation where disconnecting doesn't kick you out of the game? Or you can like pick and choose save files super easily. Why, Microsoft? Oh, I think I just answered my question. Profiles suck on Xbox Live. It's like I'm not I'm not a fanboy. Like I've I've generally picked PlayStation and Nintendo because that's where the games that I really want to play have been. But I like you you go get the console that has the games you want to play. Don't get the console and then hope the games come out. That's my always been my opinion. You know? Later on you can get the other ones. However, after having like dealt with Nintendo and Sony, like Microsoft's decisions just baffle me I like the fact that I can't even get this game to run on the the Xbox one X because like every time it tries to connect to the uh, the servers network it oh you do do not make me restart horizon 12 hours and 43 we're at we're at 13 hours and a, 13 and a half hours in Oh, you guys. Oh, I'm gut shot. I'm gut shot. What do you mean is missing? What? Okay, hold on. What? Why aren't these... These are purchased. These are... I clearly played them. During this stream. All right, let's close the game. Let's restart the oh, Xbox. Like you gave us Fable, but why do you why do you hurt me so? It's like when you have a really nice down pillow and then a fucking like the pointy part of the feather sticks through it and stabs you in the eye. Why do you hurt so good? Oh.
I swear to God, if this is what keeps me from getting the full 24 hours, like a bunch of janky DLC stuff that's functioned fine up until now. What do you want to bet this also screws with, uh, like, settings and stuff? All right. Let's try this again. Like, I don't... I completed those DLCs. Why would they suddenly be deleted? I don't care if I have to spend the next, what is it, 11, 10 hours troubleshooting, we're going to 24. You guys can just hear me screaming and cursing EA and Microsoft off camera and throwing things and shouting out credit card numbers. <laughs> In other news, though, we're what? An hour and a half? From the next prize drawing? That's pretty cool, right? And now my TV's trying to turn off. What's the new con? Okay, everything's loaded. That's good. Okay, what did we do? We talked to Garrus. Or no, we talked to Jacob. Yes, donate to Extra Life. Let my suffering be for some good. I'm on... Okay. Oh, okay, cool. Okay, so we talked to... We already have Jacob's stuff. Beautiful. Thank you, autosave. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Thank you, obsessive Mass Effect autosave. You know what? Actually, Mass Effect does have a history of, like, really obsessive autosave. The, the, the autosaves for Andromeda, like, I had, to, I had to go in and delete them on an almost daily basis when I was playing that. I'm not a pumpkin butt. You're a pumpkin butt. Also, I realized why I don't like the, the new, the comfy seat, quote-unquote, that you got for the exercise bike. Uh, it's because it's too big for my butt. <laughs> the less comfy one fits better. Is that a weird thing to say? I don't... I've been up so long, you guys. I've been up so long. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hackett, Alliance HQ. It's not small, it's proportional to my size. Thank you for your time. I'm 5'8", what okay, do you want? Brief. We have a deep cover operative out in you don't even want to, no, I can do 100 squats, no problem. Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Like, I was doing, when I was playing Final Fantasy VII, VII, I was doing squats with Cloud. So, why call me? Just this morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. I'd like, I'm short, what do you <laughs> I'm 210 and 5'8". And none of it... Well, the appropriate amount is in my butt. Not none of it. I got enough cushion to sit here for 13 hours. And believe me, I'd rather be sitting on that side of the couch. That one's still got the good springs. I don't know. I think it is. Okay, my license says 5'6". The last two times I was at the doctor... I was 5'8". Now, either I grew two inches during a pandemic, or I was a slouchy bitch and finally learned how to stand up straight. What's more likely? Alright, blah, blah. I heard she was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report said she'd found it. 
Yeah, but I mean, like, the hair, you know? Speaking of, did Faisal ever, de did Faisal ever decide what he's going to do? We, we already had the drawing for who gets to choose how I dye my hair. Did Faisal ever pick anything? I don't know, sweetheart. Your eyes are even with my nose. So that's like here, which puts the top of your head here, which... That doesn't seem like the right distance. That seems like my full... F you know what? I'm not going to do it. I'm bad at... I'm, I'm bad at math, but especially measurements. So... What else can Command you tell me? She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I thought the Alliance the Jensen's and I... team found an artifact out No, of I can't space. do that. That won't she go over at work. Device. I told you. Proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to You can do the top and the back and the sides. If or we can do all one thing. Proof, it's worth checking out. <sighs> yeah, no. Like, I'm not good at the sciences. I excel at the arts, English, history, all that kind of stuff, literature. The, the sciences, though, eh. I thought the Alliance denies the Reapers. I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. No, I said it has to won't it has to not get me fired because I literally only work eight hours this week. Like we need money. I have a hell of a squad. We've raised a lot of money today, but none of it goes out. towards me. Jensen's and also, I spent a lot of money on if this. If see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion. I very specifically did all. not leave it open, which is why I haven't included the haircut prize either. <laughs> the Batarians won't oh, that banana like screwed over my mouth. Into a secret prison. I have banana this mouth. This is not an alliance operation. Terrible. Oh, yeah. I like. I. I'm. You know. If it were an official mission, of course the Batarians would be upset. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry I'm. About. I'm fine with that. With my situation, because it's like okay, like I. My phone has a, cal a calculator. I can figure out most of that stuff. But uh, I feel like not being able, not needing to look up the differences between there, there, and there uh, benefits me more. Uh, I said blue, purple, green, yellow, white, blonde. I, I picked out colors. Ideally, the colors that I can buy at Walgreens. <laughs> it's all right. It's it's my brother-in-law. I will. Uh, it will get figured out. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground at a Batarian outpost in Aratan. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it's it. all right. Sarah wouldn't let him pick anything that'll actually get me in trouble. She uh, she looks out for me too much. She once punched a firefighter for me. Like, have you guys seen a firefighter up close? Their necks are like this thick. And she did like a running <laughs> Superman punch. Now that I say this, I want I want it to be clear. I did not piss off a firefighter. Okay. I was innocent in this situation. Uh someone happened to be dating a firefighter that we knew and um he uh was apparently trying to look out for me. Uh, because he thought I was a wimp and he was like had been drinking because we were in Milwaukee which if you're so out socially in Milwaukee you're probably in a bar and he was like all right 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 what would you do if somebody went up to you and did this and grabbed me by the neck but his hand was so fucking big that his fingers touched on the back side of my neck and she just came out of nowhere which is why my big sister is my hero. 
Who else do we have to talk to? Let's go talk to Grunt. Me? I'm the dumbass? For what? Having a slender neck? Don't fucking judge it, okay? <laughs> oh, him? Yeah. <laughs> Well, I'm not going to say all firefighters are crazy, because I know a couple that are cool, and I have some relatives who are also firefighters. But I've also met a few who seem like they have breathed in too many fumes. I would never disparage the job they do, but at a certain point, like, you're running into collapsing, burning buildings and breathing in all those chemicals and asbestos and what have you. <laughs> Summer dicks, I can, oh, there you go, see? Do some tight shits. <laughs> I have, I have nothing. I can't even dance at somebody. This mission takes me back. Oh, Zaid, you're so fucking boring. What's this? Hey, don't touch. That rifle is older than you are. Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, Jesse, that's my lucky charm. More men have been killed with that gun than died in the Like, I have nothing but respect for, you know, firefighters, though. I went through the police academy, you know? The people who take on those kind of jobs, uh, especially firefighters, because they don't really have any authority, you know? They're putting their lives on the line to help people with zero power to abuse. And before anyone asks, I do not regret continuing uh, with the Academy. <laughs> or I do not regret, regret not continuing. There we go. Jack, what's up? Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. How do you get those straps to stay Thanks just right? Like, spots. are they taped on? Are they glued? What's going on? No, I I get your drift. I know it. I I I know I know where you you're going with the Homelander there. <laughs> I have to finish watching season two. If they're helping you. That's good enough for me. Don't be my buddy. Well, they can't you be that tight. I mean, they're not like. You for these files. Let's leave it there. <laughs> your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. Bioware it. pays pretty good attention to how they, uh, and this is the perfect shot for this. Bioware pays pretty close attention to how they model their female characters. And there's no, like, there's no muffin topping or under the straps. You know? Like, those aren't even, like, Lilu Dallas thermal straps situation right there. They're looser than that. I'm about halfway through it. Robot parts? Believe me. Jack does not have... Well, she's got an amp, but other than that, she doesn't really have any robot parts. Uh, Shepard has more robot parts. What if the answers aren't what you expect? I'm not looking for answers. I'm looking for names, dates, places. Is it just me? Or does she... Occasionally, when Jack's looking at the right angle, kind of look like Pulp. Like, if you gave her, like, bright orange hair or something. And maybe slightly more tattoos. What happened A little? Okay, I'm not the only one who before. sees it. Cool. I go hunting. Anyone who's screwed with me pays. Their associates pay. Their friends pay. It might be just, the like, the jawline and the cheekbones. I'm not sure of it. Wait, what? You're gonna kill everyone? I like I don't want you to kill everyone. I won't let you go on a killing spree. Okay, I'm yeah, it's, it's it is the facial structure. After yeah. that, what I do is my business. She doesn't say the c word often enough. <laughs> what 
What's your history with Cerberus? And this is a they raised fundraising stream, so facility. I won't say it. I escaped when I was a kid. Been on the run ever since. And they've been chasing me ever since. But soon, I'm gonna chase them. You think about this a lot, Where'd she take that you? gun out of? I go to sleep with this. I wake up with it. Everyone I kill, I pretend it's the So if you're watching on a computer, me. if you just look down below, there's an actual, like, leaderboard and a link for the Extra Life donation. Otherwise, Sarah's got it for you right there. Thank you, sweetheart. You don't have to live in this pit, you know. It's dark, quiet, and hard to find. That spells safety to me. I mean, it's literally down a staircase. You know, this ship is a powerhouse. You could go Not a problem, Lightning. Live like a queen. I could help. We have to stop the collectors. I don't have time for piracy. When this also, is done, I don't have an eye patch. be dead or out here in space with this ship. Think about it. Lots of creds. Freedom to go wherever you want. And all the mayhem and fighting I could want. You know what? It sounds like fun, but somewhere out there, there's a brainy blue archaeologist. And I've got to find her. What is it about somewhere killing that fascinates you so much? I figure every time someone dies and it's not me, there. my chances of survival go up. Simple. Beneath the pale moonlight. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> we do have some eye patches somewhere around from like kid costumes. I should go. You should find a yep. shirt. It's drafty in here. You're gonna catch a cold. I don't think your biotics can stop that. Where is Grunty? Shepard. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open. Not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo. Then focus on engines. Are That's you... what tank imprints show about human ships anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. So like you were raised on a boob tube. a child. Just remember this, picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. What other human infos floating around in there? Left Weak points, probably. Deep to sever your spine. <laughs> Called You're it. Soft. Solarian, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Here's my much little test tube, baby. Much point. Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as He's you He's super die. into classical I'm music. Suffering the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were By the weak. way, that grunt plushie strong, is still in the prize pool, needed. people. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak. Pitiful. Ryan Walker, thank you so much for the $25 donation. That gets you in the prize pool. Let's get you in there. Hold on. We are running out of room on this wheel. Uh, ba -ba -da -ba. Yeah, it does whatever you do, uh, whatever you put in, put it in as during the donation. I think it lets you do it anonymous, anonymously or change your name, but... <laughs> no worries. Most people have had their real names donated. Or real names, uh, yeah. Real names out. Except for Jamaican Jesus. That was an interesting one. So you started small. He won the SR2 hat. You are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. 
I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Cool. Shepard. Anything in your tank? Can we give you Might your gun? something I could put together. Don't know how useful it will be. I'm still not in the Animal Crossing. <laughs> Did I? Wait. Oh, it's a prototype. That's right. Krogan shotgun. It's platinum. Why has it got to be platinum? Freaking everything is platinum. I can take that palladium, though. 15,000. Melee attacks. I'll take that. Shepherd. That being said, speaking of Switch games, you guys, the new uh, Hyrule Warriors comes out in like 12 days. <laughs> James told what? Streaming Animal Crossing. Don't think there's a single bat. Um, no main, no main characters. Yeah, the twentieth. It's it's coming up fast. I got reminded of it today. That's all for now. Shepard. What did James tell me? All right, we're we're almost at fourteen hours here. My short-term memory is going. It's mostly focused on how weird my tongue feels. All right, so we still got to talk to Miranda. Arrival. I'm pretty sure Arrival is like, that's the last thing I want to do in the game, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, he, I don't think he actually ever said to hold on to it. He said just, you know, start probing everything. Okay, we got to do this. We got to do this N7 thing. Got to talk to Miranda. And then we got to do Kasumi and Zaid's missions. And we have Tali and the Justicar and the Assassin. Ooh, hard to pick a favorite between Tali and the Assassin. Lightning, thank you so much for the host. I hope you guys are all having fun. By the way, if you are having fun, please check me out on YouTube at Jeffrey Gaming. The link for it is right here. Gonna try to sleep. No problem, sweetheart. You get some rest. Uh, the link for it's right there. I stream three times a week, usually sometimes four, but I also upload videos to YouTube uh, Monday through Friday every week. Uh, not only are all the streams archived over there, but the videos I upload are completely separate Let's Plays. So if you have any interest in uh, Mega Man Legends, that's what I'm playing over there right now. So go check that out. And subs are totally free over there, and they are a great way to help support the channel. Uh, we're five subs away from hitting 100. And if I do that, I get to pick my own YouTube URL. It's no more youtube.com slash undercase U capital X y r eight three six two under slash <laughs> gonna dip before i pass out good luck thank you so much thank you you get some rest have a great night and thank you so much i'll let you know uh if uh oh wait no you didn't you only did the five dollars that's right that's all right i i uh i'm getting i'm having trouble remembering what everybody donated now which is why i have i've been writing it down <laughs> uh, but I'll still be going in the morning So If you wake up and I'm still on Feel free to swing by Describe a delicious breakfast to me Shepard I find myself in the unpleasant position Of asking for your help I don't like discussing personal matters But this is important Mar 
Randy, you're one of my crew. Is it about how Tell you don't have a tan mind. and you're you the palest what person I told ever? You about father building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. Why do I feel like this story is about to change? So you think your father's tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources Fem Shep is the boss. And, and uh, my canon, her, her name's Jordan. Jordan her Shepherd. Life, but I'm out of options. I don't know why I picked that name, but it's just the one He's that feels the most right. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical, but she deserves a normal life, and she's going to get it no matter what. Did your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. I told Cerberus, and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. Yeah, we can help out with that. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. <coughs> My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nos Astra docking bay. All right, can do. On that note, though, we did hit the 14-hour mark, which means it is time for the two-hour break. Not, the break isn't two hours. The break's going to be ten minutes. It's been two hours since I took a break. I've got to get up and stretch and uh, grab some water, uh, you know, do all that kind of stuff. Thank you, everybody, so much for hanging out, and thank you, everyone, for all the donations. You guys rock. You're amazing. Uh, like I said, it's going to be a short ten-minute break. Um... You guys should get up and stretch or do whatever you got to do too. I hope to see you here when I get back. If not, have a great rest of the night.